this car, a Proton Weera, not really a standout. I mean, it looks pretty good in these shell colors. It's a rally car from 20 years ago, but this is actually a Malaysian legend. This car was street raced flat out through Kuala Lumpur by Michael Schumacher. The owner of the car, rally driver Saria, I'm gonna ask him to tell this story because it's not a well-known Michael Schumacher story. It's an epic tale though. It's one of the legends. This car is just something else. So I'm gonna go straight over to Saria. He can tell the story of that amazing day. Hi folks. My name is Surya Sankaran. I just addressed myself as Surya. And I, I worked with Shell in the past and in, way back in 1993 to 2005. And year 1999, uh, as an employee of Shell, Shell was kind enough to sponsor me as a privateer in one of the rally championship in northern state of Malaysia in Perlis. So we were a private team and we were rallying. And the color scheme that you see down here is the livery color from DJR Australia in the abbreviation. The full name is Dick Johnson uh, Racing Australia. They raced the Ford Falcon V8s in Australia. So this is the car that I use for competing in rally championship. And uh, this is the car that, you know, in way, way back in 2003, uh, when I was also assigned to work for Scuderia Ferrari, whenever they hit Sepang, Formula One, Grand Prix, my job is to take care, is to do ho a peak hospitality and I take care of the Formula One crews uh, that is uh, mainly the fuel uh, and, the, and the lubricant engineers. At the same time, I also coordinate the press uh, conferences for Michael to attend. So 2000, 2001, it went smoothly. And in 2003, when this uh, Michael was supposed to be picked up, uh, just after the Marlboro press conference at Sepang Pan Pacific Hotel, when he came out from the hotel and Michael saw my rally car, uh, of course, it was already tamed down to the road uh, usage uh, without the spotlights and normal road tires. And Michael had an MPV parked in front and he said, I'm not taking the MPV, I'm going to drive this Proton, or uh, whatever car it is here. He knows it's my car because he's seen me two years earlier. So for, I also reminded Michael for his own safety reason, I would prefer him to come in the MPV, but he actually took over the car and, and I was also interrupted by John Todd. And John Todd said, you might as well teach Michael how to use the car because you're running out of time. And we had a wonderful, pleasant journey in the car, accompanied also by the Shell uh, Global Sponsorship Director, Juan Carlos Perez, who actually sat in the rear seat. The car actually had an half cage in front and one Carlos was hanging dearly with a road cage and with a normal safety belts. So Michael took off from Pan Pacific Hotel, heading towards uh, Cyberjaya Lodge, which is about 35 kilometers away. And um, the journey was amazing. We had a lot of conversation on the car. He was talking about the weather condition. He was also asking me where to do some shopping for his wife. Uh, Corina, he wanted to, she wanted to buy a Louis Vuitton handbag, but she was not looking forward to get an original one, but she rather get one from China Street. So a lot of conversation about Michael in that uh, journey, and I was observant on his driving skills on the car as we were passing speeds beyond 200 kilometers, right, on the empty highway, and as we hit the toll gate, and then when we exited the toll gate, we are supposed to take and exit about one kilometer off to Cyberjaya Lodge. I was about to remind Michael that he was on the wrong pathway of the highway. He was on the speed line. He was supposed to exit towards the left. But actually what Michael was doing, he was taking a racing line from outside into the uh, apex, into the exit of the line of the highway. I would not be able to do that in 200 kilometers. Michael did that. He dropped from fifth gear to fourth gear. He just floored the car. He was just slightly gently correcting the steering wheel and his throttle foot was flat on because I can still hear the engine screaming up in the fourth gear maximum. And he maneuvered the car and all the way back to Cyberjaya. And he asked me, Surya, uh, when he stationary the car back on the hotel and uh, we got away decoy from all the reporters that's normally waiting in the lobby. We went to the back of the hotel. He asked me, Surya, what do you want? Well, I said, Michael, I have all your autograph pictures. I just wish you and Corina uh, a successful uh, race here in Malaysia. 
and uh, your family time, great family time with yourself and your family, and uh, you know, uh, keep on winning for Shell Ferrari. And Michael took out his pen and said, Surya, can I scribble down your roof, roof lining, you know? And actually, he sat there, he signed of Schumacher Many Tanks uh, 2003. That signature, I made a replica of the signature and I made a sticker right to the bonnet. The original sticker uh, signature is on the roof of the car. This is uh, the graphics that test driven uh, during the Formula One uh, GP 2003 by Schumacher. And um, we, when he was coming out from the car, I quickly took hold of my SLR camera, took a picture of him leaving the car, which later he autographed that to Surya Schumacher many thanks. And he signed off also 2003. I'm going to show you the pictures now and run through all the pictures gallery. Let's go to the picture gallery, folks. Now I'm going to show you some of the pictures and the memories with Michael Schumacher in 2003. Remember the incident when I told you that when he boarded the car? This is the picture of Michael in Pan Pacific Hotel getting on to the Proton Vera. It's actually a Shell rally car that's a privately owned by myself and we were using it for competitions in rally championship series and we finished many rally championship series way back in 1999 and in 2003 during the media press conference Michael decided to drive this Proton Vera uh, despite we have arranged him an uh, MPV, a chauffeur driver to bring him to the hotel menu he wanted to drive the, the Proton Vera uh, prepared rally car, all right? So this is the picture of Michael Schumacher actually uh, 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 adjourning uh, to the hotel in Cyberjaya Lodge. He, as he was coming up from the car, I called him Michael and he just gave me a glare and in the back you can see Juan Carlos Perez. He's the Shell Global Sponsorship Director, uh, now resides in Switzerland and he has signed this with to Surya Schumacher many thanks. This is the original photograph and a picture of Michael Schumacher when they actually asked him what kind of speed do you drive in your country he said he winked his eye at me and he said uh, I, I will adhere to the speed limit in any country I drive cars he just passed 230 in my car and a picture a group picture in 2003 with Michael Schumacher's autograph here as well and way back in 2000 earlier uh, we had a Michael Schumacher and his picture here and this is a poster that he made and gave me earlier with his signature all right and if you follow some articles here, it talks about it talk, talks about Schumacher racing away in a Proton, and it talks about my rally car is actually my family car is my rally car, and a personal experience which I actually gave the Asian Auto magazine the full transcript what actually took place in the whole um, incident where Michael actually sh sh uh, took over the car and drove the car from Pan Pacific Hotel to Cyberjaya Lodge. We had a long conversation in that car and I was so touched about his sincerity and how close he is he's with the society and the human aspect of Michael Schumacher. And, um, and, and he's a guy with a great gift and ability in driving. So uh, I still pray hard for him. Uh, keep fighting, Michael. Keep fighting, Michael. We have been praying for you, you know, so. Um, so hope to, that you have enjoyed the entire story that I've actually recapped about Michael Schumacher. Thank you very much.